All right, fans, that was action. Gentlemen, I hate to interrupt your private conversation. But don't. We are sick and tired. I don't want to stand out here and yell and scream like a lot of my cohorts do. But it's very simple. Mad Dog, Wally, Carbo. That, he is the most slick-tongued person in the world when you're talking to him about money, but he comes out here and sounds so homey, it's beautiful. Why does everybody blame Mr. Heenan for what they cannot do, for what they cannot accomplish? And then they start to make all sorts of provisions. What it comes down to is this. These people try, and I think because they fail consistently, that Stanley Blackburn and the championship committee and Mr. Wally Carbo and promoters from throughout the world are so prejudiced. I would imagine they are sick and tired of me being the heavyweight champion. But it's, sorry gentlemen, you have to respect what is being done and taking place. I am the man. But what do they want to do? They want to stick me back into the ring with Mad Dog Vashon. Now, here's a man that, as far as he was could be concerned, if he lost the match but injured me and I could not wrestle and had to forfeit the championship, there's nothing he would do more than sit around and smile. He would just be happy as a lark. But I think it's pathetic and it's a sad situation that I am being forced into this. And at the same time I'm being forced into this, what do they do? They want to blame everything on Mr. Heenan. You're well, incompetent, gentlemen. You know what happens. Pretty soon they're going to start blaming me for the great year the Minnesota uh, Gophers had. Or the Vikings are having. You're going to start blaming me for everything. <clears throat> Mr. Vachon, and I use it very loosely. He says he's got something in store for me that'll shake me up. The whole, you, wrestling, shock you. the whole wrestling world, what could you do to me? You got a mind like a, like a, like a mutt that's been hit by four cars, and you're going to try to battle minds with me? What could you have in store? Nothing, pal, nothing. I right, thank you very much.